Imagine earning the first million dollar contract in Hollywood and losing everything over a disputed 10 minute act with no actual witnesses. Roscoe Fatty Arbuckle became the highest paid entertainer in the world in 1921 and his scandal the original example of cancel culture. On Saturday, September 3rd of that year, Arbuckle and a few friends drove up from Los Angeles to San Francisco for a weekend party at the St. Francis Hotel. They stayed inside a 12-story suite where the party raged continuously for three days. In attendance, minor actress Virginia Rapp, like Arbuckle 26, became severely ill during the proceedings. She was found delirious, naked, and bleeding after screaming in Suite 1219. She died four days later from a ruptured bladder. Arbuckle's group had long fled before he would be arrested and tried for murder. Three trials later, he was acquitted, but his career remained in ruins. The day after he signed a contract with Warner Brothers in 1933, he suffered a fatal heart attack.